Okay, so what's up guys, I'm Pixel Sammy and I'm back with another new Final Cut Pro video and this particular video is very unique because this is something I'm doing for the first time and this is one of the things which I always wanted to do such as this one. And you can do this totally in Final Cut Pro. Yes, you have to purchase the plugin, but the thing is, this particular plugin is so inexpensive and the thing it does is so seamless that I feel that it's totally worth it for you guys to purchase this particular pack. And this is called Pixel Film Studios Surface Tracker. And this is such an amazing panel. Just look at the examples which I made on the screen. And these are made totally on Final Cut Pro. So what this particular plugin does, say for example, you have a shot and you want something to follow the surface, maybe some kind of overlay or a picture or a logo or any kind of a branding thing, which you want to put on the surface of this particular, maybe wall, maybe bus, maybe animal, maybe anything. You want to just put on it and you want to track it in a 3D space on the surface itself and that is very hard it is very complicated to do it in any software out there but with this particular plugin it just does the job so seamlessly all you have to do is just drag this particular effect drag the overlay or the video or the photo you want to put it in and that is pretty much it I made some adjustments right here you know to make it a bit more seamless and you are good to go that is so easy to do so in this particular video i'm going to just show a very rapid tutorial on how to make this particular surface tracking with this particular pixel film studio surface tracker and let's jump straight into final cut pro and see what this particular video is all about okay so i'm here in final cut pro and this is the footage which i'm going to use as you can see this is a horse who is moving and i want to just use this particular horse's body to portray a particular icon in my case i'm using the final cut pro logo so the first thing which you need to do is you need to drag the pixel film studios surface tracker effect onto this particular clip just drag and drop it from the effects panel after that go to the inspector panel and you're going to see this particular step click on open editor and then you're going to see this particular panel opening and in the right side there are several functions so in simple words you have to create points so that it can create the tracking points right so there are two ways to do so one is a rectangular method another one is a circular method both you can do to make a rectangular or a circular tracking point just like this and also there is one more thing called a tracking layer it is currently in single layers it can be done in multi layers also if you want to create a more smoother tracking such as your face or something very circular in nature in that case you have to use the multi-layer one but in my case i'm going to just use the single layer one that is going to be enough for this particular clip so after that i'm going to just create some random points on the body of the horse just like this just place the points on those particular areas where you want the effect or the tracking to happen and not the entire video because it is going to take up a lot of space in your graphics memory as well as it is going to slow down your computer a lot after that make sure it is in the first frame of the video and then click on the forward tracking button this might take some time depending on your clip so just wait patiently once it is done you are going to see several tracking points there in the timeline just like this and if you want to make this tracking a bit more seamless then before tracking click on that particular pre-track controls and then increase the amount so that the contrast increases which can help you track a bit better in this particular panel of course i did not need it but you might require it as per your necessities after that's done it is pretty simple to use of course if you want to smoothen the motion tracking you can do so there are loads of different functions which you can try but in my case i don't need it because it is already doing a good job on its own now what you need to do is you need to create that particular mesh for the tracking so in the mesh controls click on add triangular mesh so after the triangular mesh is done and you are okay with the tracking which you just made just click on export data after that you're going to see a gray portion on your tracking points so here you're going to put this particular picture or a logo or whatever you guys want onto your object and make sure that the picture which you are putting has no edges to it means it is more or less a png kind of a picture because of the reason which i'm going to show right now so in the drop down button i'm going to just click on the final capture logo just like the way you drop down any kind of pictures out there in any kind of plugins and then as you can see as this is a very rough mesh the border is not a perfect rectangle or a circle or something right so in order to just prevent this you need to scale down this particular logo just like this and of course adjust the x and y position of it and you are good to go so this is like the final result 
and as you can see it is doing the job pretty well and it is focusing the movement as well as the body movement of the horse pretty well so we can say that the plugin is doing its job pretty well so as you can see this is the final result and here are some other examples too so i hope you guys like this particular video if you guys like this particular video the purchase link to this particular product is there in the description below if you want to check it out it is fairly inexpensive for what it does and it does it really good if not best it does it really good for the price and with that being said if you guys want to watch more such videos press the subscribe button comment down below like this particular video and i'm pixel samuel we'll be back with another video soon peace out